Um, to be honest, it was really different because, you know, I wasn't really used to having to compete at all times because I was always, like, ahead of some people. But coming in now, I'm, like, restarting all over. I'm at the bottom of, the, like, the list. And I got to build my way up and just compete because if you don't compete, you're not going to play here. You just got to stay on top of your stuff. You got to uh, study on huddle. When you home, you just got to stay on top of your grades. And you just got to lead by example. That uh, that class is really special. I feel like they're going to do big things when they come up. Uh, just lead, like lead by example, like talk to them, like just be a leader. Their expectations is, you know, always playing at a high level, but most importantly, just competing. That's what we uh, strive to do in our program. The person that's telling me the most is probably Makai, because like, he tries to lead me and do the right thing, and, you know, because he's experienced it for like four years now. Yeah, BC, he, he's a great coach. He, he just wants us to work harder. You know, he runs us a lot, but it, it's, it's better for us. It's helping us. Uh, well, I actually like the underclassmen. They, it's fun to have around. Uh, it's good to have them around, just mentor them, show them how to do the right stuff. My responsibility as a basketball player for State Family is being more vocal, knowing all the plays, and taking care of the ball. We just, he just wants us to play as a team and work with each other. Like it's do or die time right now. It is a different season. It is a different mindset. Yeah, we've been talking about playoffs and state and all that stuff all the time because that's how we're built. But now that it's really here, it's really different. Now. It's really different. I don't care who we're playing. Every moment matters. Every moment. We coach different. We hold you accountable different. Tighten this thing up starting right now. Yes, sir. Here we go. Come on, so we're waiting on right here. This is it, right here. You know, the thing about um, being a young guy, um, you know, you're coming into a, I would say, a pretty established program uh, with, with some established guys already. You know, sometimes it can be a little difficult to kind of find your footing, um, especially when you're used to being, you know, one of the better players, uh, probably in your class, and you're making that transition from eighth grade to ninth grade. Now you're kind of at the bottom of the of, of the totem pole per se. You know, but our guys have one; they've gotten great experience. You know, they're they're practicing every day, um, they, they're learning a lot, um, they're going up against other guys that have been in the program. They can kind of, you know. Um, model what it is that, that we, what, what we're looking for and what we want to see each and every day in terms of attitude in terms of effort um, and I think they've done a real good job of of just buying in and accepting that it's it's, it, it, it's not easy you know it's not it's not easy you know you you're used to to being the bell cow you know you're used to being a person that has a, a major impact on the team's success and now you're coming in and you're trying to figure out what role can you play? Because you go from being probably a star player in eighth grade to being a role player in ninth grade. And that, and that can be tough for guys. And, and, but that transition is made easier by, you know, older guys in the program, you know, again, just modeling and showing them what it is that it is that we want from those guys on a daily basis. Um, talking a little bit about some of our guys, um, you know, we have, we have a really good young core. Um, in our freshman class, we have Nate McAdory, um, DeAndre Barrett and Dorian Onwuchekwa and all of those guys will play a major role for us. As a matter of fact, they already have. I mean, one, again, they're in practice every day and they're, and they're helping our older guys, you know, stay sharp. Um, DeAndre Barrett started some games for us. Um, he's played a, a big role for us this year and got some valuable experience that's going to bode well from him as his future continues. Um, Dorian Onwuchekwa, I mean, he's a low. He's, Probably one of the better bigs in the class, maybe even the country. Um, and you know he's only going to get better. And again, going up against guys like Makai and Brandon every single day, you know those guys push. You. you know those guys, you know they're physical, they're tough, um, they're athletic. So you know he has to he has to go deep in his bag every day, you know, to, to be successful here. Um, Nate Nate McIver is another one. You know he's a guy that again he brings it and. You know, he's learning how to compete, you know, he's learning, you know, and that's the thing, not just him, but guys in general, you know, 
learning that every day matters. You know, there is no no, no day off per se. Uh, and that's one thing that he's learned. And you know, once once that light switch comes on for these guys where they, they get that part of it that, you know, there's an expectation of being an everyday guy and they accept that. I, I, I mean, it's not just our guys, it's young guys across the country in this sport. I mean, that's that's the biggest thing in most part, in, in, in most cases, is them just understanding and learning how hard they have to compete every single day to earn everything. Nothing's given. Um, in our sophomore class, we even got some talent. Um, um, JT Toppin is a name to, to definitely, you know, look out for um, in terms of the future here at Faith Family. I mean, he's a kid that came in about 6'3", maybe 150 pounds or so. Uh, now he's close to 6'7", and, you know, upwards of 190. And, um, again, just developing, staying in the weight room. He runs hard. He listens. And um, he's going to be a guy that's going to really have an effect on our program here in the near future. So we're excited about our guys, man. We're excited about the, 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 the young core of this program, not just their future, but what they're able to contribute now and what they've already done.